August 17, 1969, Hurricane Camille slams into the Gulf Coast, making landfall just east of the mouth of the Mississippi River. The Category 5 storm kills more than 250 people more than 35 years before Hurricane Katrina devastates the region. 1998. They did not constitute sexual relations as I understood that term to be defined. In Washington, President Bill Clinton faces federal grand jury questioning in the Monica Lewinsky scandal. That's where he finally admits his past relationship with the former White House intern. Afterward, Clinton tells the American people. Indeed, I did have a relationship with Ms. Lewinsky that was not appropriate. In fact, it was wrong. It constituted a critical lapse in judgment and a personal failure on my part for which I am solely and completely responsible. 1896. There are strange things done in the midnight sun by the men that toil for gold. Prospectors find gold in Canada's Yukon Territory, a discovery that touches off the Klondike gold rush in the following year. 1807, Robert Fulton's steamboat begins its successful round trip up the Hudson River from New York City to Albany, New York. The voyage of the North River steamboat, popularly known as the Claremont, revolutionizes American transportation in the 19th century. 1987, Rudolf Hess, the last member of Adolf Hitler's inner circle in Nazi Germany, dies of an apparent suicide at age 93. Hess was the sole inmate at Spandau Prison in what was then West Berlin, serving a life sentence for war crimes. And 1943. You talking to me? You talking to me? You talking to me? Well, I'm the only one here. Actor Robert De Niro is born in New York City. Among his films, Taxi Driver, The Godfather, Part Two, Raging Bull, Goodfellas, and Analyze This. Today in History, August 17th, Sophia Manos, The Associated Press.